Hello guys and welcome to Plantera. I'm going to be completely upfront and uh, honest with you people. And this uh, game actually was given to me by the developer. Um, I know it's already out, but uh, this is a review copy that was just sent to me and I didn't check my email for some ungodly reason. I know bad on me, you should guys all should just tell me. But this is actually a review copy uh, for a game called Plantera. This is also by a... I forget what the company name is. Um, I didn't do much research on this. I actually just got this. So I believe this is a clicker game along the vein of something like Cookie Clicker. I believe or something along one of those lines. Um, I'm actually a fan of those kind of games. So I don't know how to do this. I am going to be just showing you. It has a good menu for languages. If you speak different languages, of course you have English and you have Japanese, which are the two languages I speak. I speak a little bit of Swedish, not much. Um, all the people who made it um, forget the company that made it to be completely honest with you they also made Loot Hero DX and Loot Hero by extension you have your sound and all that options but there are no sliders here it's just like on off so I believe the controls so Wasad is well, A and D are your and also the controls are your uh, camera movements so you get money by doing that this is actually my first time loading it up other than getting it ready for what I was doing before so let's see how this works out it might be slow it might be I don't know up oh. I understand it now. Okay. It is a waiting game. It's an idle game. Let's plant again. Okay, so this makes more sense. It's an idle game. It is a almost complete idle game, except I don't know if it has an offline portion of it. Or anything like that. I know that certain parts of it okay so I can do that to get more money hmm I can get a blueberry bush I believe I don't know we're gonna be checking up on this game every once in a while um, seeing how it's doing um, all that good stuff all that good fun Dude, you have blueberries. Okay, I get it now. I understand this game now. I actually kind of understand it. Uh, okay. We need 500 coins to go that way. There's a whole lot of space to go that way. There's 500 coins to go that way or that way. We have two of them now. It's an interesting game, I'll admit. It's a clicker game, though, at ultimately. I need 30 coins. I don't know what I'm going to do with 30 coins. Okay, well then. I understand just a little bit better now. Um, certain things are opening up. They're going to collect all the food. I believe these fall off at some point. I don't know when that is, or I've got to click on myself. Does he go and collect them? He does. Okay, so then I've got to get rid of all the little animals. 
This is like a typical clicker game. Everything gets very complex very, very quickly. And I like that about, click about clicker games. Except this is a game that I play by myself. Um, I wouldn't play it on stream or anything like that. If you like clicker games, um, like Adventure Capitalist, or um, Time Clickers, or uh, this developer has made Loot Heroes DX, if you like a game like that, if you don't know what that game is, go look it up. Um, yeah, something like that. Go look it up, and, whoop, level 4. I've got stuff now. I don't know what it does. Does it just collect things as it falls on the ground? Go away, you stupid bird. Did the bird just poop an egg? I think the bird just pooped an egg. Yeah, bird just pooped an egg. Go away, you stupid bird. It's getting very complex very, very quickly. We're at 96. Fox runs away because the fox wants the chicken. I kind of understand a little bit better but if you want to play something like this please do um, it is on Steam I will put a link in the description as always and we'll be popping in on this game about how uh, I'll say once a week uh, and I'll, I'll give it once a week to check back up on this game this will be our, uh, our game but once again it is completely sponsored I will the key is given to me for uh, by the company uh, what that company's name is, I don't know. I should probably find out. Go away, you stupid fox. But I actually am having kind of fun uh, playing this. I believe... Oh man, I can't stop playing. It's getting to that stage. Go away. And of course, the bird does the pooping noise. As the bird makes the pooping noise. Getting close to level 5. I will stop it when we get to level 5. How about that? There's level 5. Huh. Get a scarecrow for 2500 or 225 250. I don't know why I can't speak. Uh I don't know. There's no incentives. Get some of the rutabagas. Do they give a higher profit margin? Go away, you stupid bird. Yeah, I'm gonna stop this as soon as we get up and we see if these make any higher profit margin. And uh, yeah, we will check back up on this in a week. I will promise you guys that. Want of carrots. Yeah, I think that'll be it for uh, today's episode because this game will start to get me addicted. I will completely be honest with everyone about that. Anyone who knows me in gaming will know that I like I, I get addicted to certain games, and that's all I play. 
Stupid bird, go away. Okay. Yep. This has been Plantera. If you want to check it out, um, please do. We will see this game again very, very soon. Stupid mole. And yeah. Bunny, go away. I can't find a stopping point. <laughs> Every time. Yeah, so we will... I don't know what that is. Guys, just keep going. What did that do? I don't know. Okay, before I get more distracted. Ah, <laughs> so much stuff going on on the screen. And awesome music. I, I actually like the music. Um, uh, there's not a lot of good games that have good music like this. And we will see you guys in the next episode of this as we continue on with our little farm we have working here. And we will see you guys on the next episode. So have a good day, guys. Bye.